you play a fantastic and naughty character. Yeah. Are you ever like that in real life? Hopefully not. I think, I mean, I, I do love to laugh and I love to giggle. I don't really, um, I don't do a lot of parachuting. I definitely don't do cocaine and I definitely, uh, I don't, I don't do a lot of jumping naked out of trunks, so I probably have very little in common, except that we do both like to laugh, so that's probably what we have in common. We should do more of those things. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, well, at least the laughing part. I don't think any of those other stuff would, 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 would kill me, so. <laughs> and you mentioned your kids. Do you tell them about these films, or do you just pretend you're off somewhere else doing them? Oh, I tell them it's somebody else. It's not me. Yeah, no, it's not me. Daddy, that's you. No, it's not, not me. Not me. Nope, nope, nope. No, I, 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 like my kids. Uh, no, they don't. They don't know me from these. They do know that Daddy's an actor, but they, but that's that's, and they see me in some more family-friendly films and TV shows that I do. But, um, but no, it, I, I do think though my we our family definitely is blessed with a really good sense of humor, just about life in general. So I, I'm very confident, um, at least hopeful, that my kids have a really good sense of humor about why 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 Daddy's making these bold character choices. They're not personal choices. I don't jump naked out of rooms in my house or something like that. No, no. I've stopped. I like Dad, <laughs> please stop, Dad. Daddy, stop. <laughs> We've got friends over. We've got friends over. <laughs> it's never happened. Just a joke. Just a joke. And you're actually one of the nicest actors I've ever met. Can you Shut up. Me? No, you are. <laughs> you are sweet. Shut up. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Again, just a joke. I hope this I hope this translates. I'm so sorry. Have I offended? Have, okay, okay. Can you please give us your top tip on staying down to earth amidst all this madness? Not believe. I, I I still can't believe any of this. So when I when I quit my day job as a physician, all I ever wanted to be was just an actor who had lines in movies. That was it. I just wanted to have parts in movies. It didn't matter if they were big or small, and I just want to be. I just want to see myself on the screen and just. Oh, I have one line of dialogue. That was kind of the dream. So to have, to be acting at this level is beyond surreal. And it's not that long ago that, you know, I had a day job. So for me, I, I really can't believe any of this. And every bit of success I've had in the last four years is solely due to The Hangover. I owe, I owe my whole career to The Hangover. It really changed my life from black and white to Technicolor. It just, it just changed everything. And, and I'm able to, I'm able to do what I love full time and, and it's actually when we're talking about our, my kids it's great I do feel like you know, it's great when, when my kids see you know when, when kids see their parents happy doing what they love to do that's really the joy you know that, that daddy comes home happy every day Aww. Yeah. your house sounds great it, yeah it's, it's <laughs> actually yeah it, it, we're, we're a happy little Asian family <laughs> <laughs> yeah happy little Asians you happy Asians, you're the best. <laughs> so this is the third film, so quick game yeah. of threes. What to do? Kiss, marry, or push off a cliff? Kiss, marry, or push off a cliff. Okay, okay. And it's the animals from the film, so we've got monkey, lion, giraffe. Monkey, I would kiss the monkey, uh, marry the giraffe, and push the lion off a cliff. Or the tiger, yeah, the tiger. Yeah, push the tiger off a cliff, sure. Safe choice. Yeah, safe choice. And of the three movies, which of the characters has been the funniest, the biggest diva, and the biggest pest? Um, actually, to be honest, in all seriousness, this is the most ego, diva-free, ego-free set of any project I've ever worked on. Zach, Ed, and Bradley, they couldn't be more grounded individuals. I mean, they're all role models to me because they have no ego, and, and they've, they're the same. Bradley's a huge movie star, Oscar-nominated now. BAFTA nominated now, so he is a superstar and still the same guy I've known like six years ago. And Zach I've known from stand-up 14 years ago, and Ed I worked with the movie before the first Hangover, and they're they're such great, genuinely grounded people. Um, I love them dearly. Isn't that single one that's a pest? No, it really isn't. I mean, it's actually, and that's the thing I'll miss the most out of all doing these three movies is the fact that everyone's been such pure joy to work with. But yeah. It's just been amazing. It's been that good. Happy little Asians. Happy little Asians, yeah.